Well, thank you so much. Wow, it's great to be here. I, you know what, I love this time of year, don't you, man? People are out, and, you know, people are playing music in the street, they're busking, and I gotta tell you, when I see a busker in the street, I don't just see a busker. You know what I see? I see the first people that will be eaten by zombies when zombies come, <laughs> allowing us valuable time to escape. I always throw a couple of coins in the case. I figure that's cheap insurance, you know what I mean? <laughs> and uh, look, we all know there's many kinds of zombies, don't we? We're adults here. There's mind slave zombies, there's chemical zombies, but there is one zombie that the world has yet to see, and I think it could be the most terrifying zombie of all. And if not the most terrifying, for sure, the most annoying. Attack of the vegan zombies, attack <laughs> of the vegan zombies, the common to break down your door. If you live in a co-op organic food store, <laughs> attack of the vegan zombies, vegan zombie girl, vegan zombie boy, they're feasting on flesh, substitute made entirely of soy. It's 100% certified locally sourced terror. <laughs> They're gonna make you a deadly protein shake. <laughs> if they can find non-GMO ingredients, for heaven's sake. Oh, they're undead. They don't butter their bread. They're roaming the city looking for fair trade coffee. <laughs> they're zombies. You gotta shoot them in the head. Since they're vegans, don't worry if they're alive or dead. Either way, we're gonna win. Just shoot them. <laughs> Is this how it ends? With the stench of rotting flesh and patchouli. You're gonna pray, my friends, that you had voted for the Greens or the NDP, but it'll be too late. They'll have your nuts on a plate. They're vegans, they're zombies. Run for your life. One's outside right now, locking up their bike. Thank you. Hoping that wasn't too intense for the children. Uh, I have kids. I have two boys of my own, and I love them. I totally recommend being a parent. Maybe some of you are here tonight, and you're not parents yet, but you're thinking, hey, maybe one day in the future, I'd like to get punched in the nuts a lot. <laughs> well, having kids is a great way to do that, I found. Uh, I have to say, one thing I'm immensely grateful for is that I am able to share the gift of music with my kids so that they grow up knowing music is why we don't have any money. And, and I have found, I've found music from all over the world, man. That uh, children's music, I would like to play one for you now. This is a children's tune. This is uh, 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 from China. This is a Chinese children's song. Every child is beautiful, a gift to the world. To produce one is an honor. Unless it is a girl <laughs> Then shame Shame, 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 shame Shame, 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 shame Your faulty seed has shamed all of China <laughs> Thanks very much, that's it for me